And now to a news for Jack's I team investigation about a Jacksonville towing company in trouble with the sheriff's office. The company is one of several JSO calls on when they need vehicles towed after crashes. News for Jack's I team investigator Kelly Wiley found JSO records showing the towing company was charging people extra fees on top of the going rate. Kelly. Yeah, like you said, they call on about 13 companies every time they need a crash cleaned up or a car towed, but they're not going to be calling on Thompson Enterprises for close to a year. This is after JSO says their investigation revealed they were breaking several of their rules. It's a coveted spot for every crash happening in Jacksonville. JSO is only calling the companies on this list of towing businesses. A JSO rate list shows tow companies can make anywhere from $116 to close to $3,000 on a single crash. So they want to get on this particular list because it's, it's basically automatic business for them. A JSO letter obtained by the News for Jack's I team states towing company Thompson Enterprises got suspended from the rotation in August after a JSO investigation discovered the company was inappropriately charging additional record fees to people. The letter says they also failed to notify JSO they changed their name and failed to have a written agreement with regard to a record tow from a private property. JSO still hasn't released the full investigation report. When you are allowed to be on this rotation list, um, it comes with a set of rules and those rules are strictly adhered. Uh, are supposed to be strictly adhered to. Once you violate these rules, the sheriff's office is going to come down on you. And the most effective way to come down on you is to take you off that list. We are still working to find out the extent of the violation. We're working to find out how much they were overcharging people. And we have requested that full investigation file from the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office. They're telling us they're working now to redact what needs to come out of it before we can get our hands on a copy. Um, but we also got in contact with the company here. Uh, I spoke to the owner on the phone and he told me he was going to give me a call back. I have yet to hear from them so far. Kelly, how do you get on this list? Well, it's actually an application that you have to fill out. And from what we understand from our crime and safety analysts, it's a pretty coveted role. It's a lot of, of constant business that's coming in. You're talking about all the car crashes we see across Jacksonville, and you're the person they're calling when they have that. They have a set out, uh, lay, set out system of fees, um, and, and it's good money. It's $3,000 uh, could get as high as that for some of these crash cleanups. Uh, so we'll continue to report on this and let you know what we find out about these violations. Reporting in Arlington, Kelly Wiley, Channel 4, The Local Station. Thanks, Kelly.